Whew, okay. Come on. <laughs> we just got the first chucker of the year. There's a chucker in there. God. I got two. guys I, uh, I know it's been a while but welcome back to the ISO channel today we've got something a little different I've got a checker hunt I'm starting it's opening day and I'm in one of my favorite spots so it should be pretty good um, it's been a good water year so there's a lot of feed for them and I haven't heard any yet but I'm just right at the truck and got about a thousand foot climb and got a climb up this stuff all the way up into the rocky rims and stuff so I think I'm alone out here today but I heard a couple gunshots way off um, sounded like shotguns so we'll see but normally there's plenty of checker and normally there's a few horns so should be a pretty good day so we'll see what we can find <sighs> okay we made it. Just right there. They're just right there. Dang it, another one just took off. I could have had that one. I'm gonna get these ones though. I got one. I got one. <laughs> I just got my first chucker of the year. No way. <laughs> Let's go. There might be more. <laughs> no way. Look at that right there. First chucker of the year. <laughs> Let's go. Oh. We just got the first checker of the year. I couldn't be happier. They're, they were right where they always are. So I chased that group one more time, but we'll go back over. And that group split in half when they first uh, jumped. So I'll, uh, I'll go chase that other group that split off, but first checker of the year. <laughs> so one shot, one kill. So actually, I took two shots, but I got got a chucker on the first shot. So that means I'm on today. So all right, let's uh, just sneak back up over this flat here and then uh, see if we can get bird number two. <laughs> okay, those other birds just went right over here. I know I've shot chucker right in this little goalie in past years too. Right here. Come on. 
Got him. I got him. <laughs> I shot that one off the ground. He was running on the skyline. Got two more. That's a triple. That's a triple. No way. <laughs> That's a triple. No way. Dude, we just went from zero to hero. What the heck? Okay. I gotta find these two. I gotta take my gun. No way. We got four birds in the back. That's half a limit. No way. Okay. I gotta find these two. Okay. I just hit a triple and then I walked up over this bank to see where they landed and I hit two more that just jumped up so I'm I don't have a dog with me so I'm gonna have to search my butt off for these but um, potentially got four more on the ground right here so I'm gonna start looking and uh, they're in some nasty stuff too so I can't shoot anymore until I get an idea where all these birds are so all right let's go find them so third chucker down just got to him right here and uh i got two more up behind me here that i gotta find and then i got one down below me um so this is this is gonna be hard picking them up by yourself is it's hard especially when they're in the rocks and they can you can kind of crawl under them i've had them do that in the past or land in a hole so let's see if i can find them okay i just shot that triple and I've been looking for about 20, probably 25 minutes, and um, I got the one up on top. The two that I shot, um, if you look at the video, I shot them, and they went right over the edge to where I couldn't see, and couldn't see where they landed. So, I, <laughs> I don't know, I just spent 20 minutes looking through this boulder field behind me there, and... Uh, yeah, it, it sucks, but um, I don't know, I've got a little bit of ground below me to look. I know there's a bird right below me um, that I shot when I looked over the edge to see where those two landed. So I'll go down there and see if I can find that one too. And I can hear the chucker just a couple hundred yards down the ridge from me. So we'll uh, grab this bird and then we'll get back on some birds. So it's, uh, yeah, it's it's not a good feeling to uh, not be able to find your birds but um, it's also kind of a lesson within itself to pick your shots so if you can't see where your birds could land then maybe don't take the shot so lesson lesson learned so let's see if we can get this last bird before we go here I did find that that other bird I took a shot at after that triple, just right here. And all because I could see him when he landed. And that makes all the difference, so. <laughs> Chucker number four, so. They seem to be pretty big birds this year, so. Well, uh, we're halfway to the limit, so we'll just head right over here and uh, see if we can pull out a couple more birds out of that cubby. So it's been a pretty good day so far, minus not finding those birds there. So, okay, starting to get pretty close. So these chucker are just right here. So I'm gonna start sneaking in on them. I think they might've jumped up on top because I stopped hearing them chuckle but <laughs> you just never know with chucker you just always have to be prepared and it's a lot easier to 
walk Chucker up a hill and stay with him than it is to come in on the top of them because they'll always fly downhill and they'll almost always walk uphill. So you can stay in them if you just walk them uphill like this. No sooner had I turned off the camera that 20 chucker pop up as I'm crawling up this draw with both my hands tied. So they just went right behind me there. So I'm just gonna side hill around because that's all I can do. They're kind of in a bad spot, but if I can see where they're gonna land when I hit them, I'll take a shot here, but I don't want to lose any more birds today, so they're just right around the corner, so I'm gonna get to them. Maybe they'll hop up on top where I can push them across the flat and chase them that way, so <laughs> that's chucker hunting for you. They're they're tough. Here we go. I got two. Got three. We got three down. We got three down. I gotta shoot this other one. Okay. We got three down. Okay, I got eyes on all of them. No way. We just hit a triple. We just got a triple down. No way. <laughs> That's two, two triples I've hit today. Here's one. One down. And one, the other one's over here. That's, that's the third one. Hang on. Okay. <laughs> Let's grab number three. Two. Two in hand. Okay, where's the third one? Here he is. <laughs> no way. Oh my goodness. That's a bag of birds. <laughs> I can't believe it. We just made a total comeback after all that. <laughs> no way. I've got one more bird till I hit my limit. So <laughs> just take my time getting some water here. <laughs> Okay, just finished up with, uh, got a little water and got something to eat. So we got seven birds in hand <laughs> and we got one more bird to go. So I can hear some chucker just down the rim for me, a couple hundred yards. So I'm not even gonna step off the rim if I don't have to. I'm just gonna stay up on top here and see if I can get my last bird. So. If I do, this will be the fastest limit that I've ever got, ever. And, oh, I can see the chucker. Dang. <laughs> He's right out there. He's skylined right now. I don't think I'd want to shoot him right there because he would go way off the rim. But maybe he's got some buddies above them, so let's go chase them.
I guess that last bird isn't going to be that easy. So we'll uh, keep walking down the rim here. That's what I usually do. And normally there's a few groups out here, but I don't hear any right now, but we'll see. So we'll keep, keep trying. I just flushed a group. I'm hoping there's some spares left that didn't take off. I got my one. I can't shoot. <sighs> Dang. <laughs> that was a shot. Now how the heck am I going to get to that one? I don't think he's alive. I think I smoked him pretty good. Holy cow, there was a lot of chucker right there. <laughs> I, uh, so this is something that I do when I do shoot him off the rim, is I'll take, here, I'll show you guys. Okay, so this is something I do do when I shoot one over the rim and I have to hike around to go get it. I've got a bunch of flagging and I'll take the whole roll. Holy cow. All those guys just took off. So I'll take a whole roll of ribbon. Well, this is my last bird, so I can use the whole roll. And I'll chuck it over. And, uh, that way I know that's where my bird is so I can find it pretty easy. You can always put a pin on Onyx, but it's nice to know like I saw where the bird landed and I know where the ribbon is. So I know that the bird is within uh, 15 feet of that ribbon, but I just saw a bird take off right out of the spot where my bird went down. So hope there was just a lot of chucker in there. So hopefully, Hopefully that wasn't the one I shot. So we'll uh, I'll figure out how to get down here and see if we got a bird or not. Okay, just got over the nastiest part of this rim. So I got down here, I found my ribbon right above me and there's a big old feather trail coming down the hillside. And so I just followed the feathers, followed the feathers, followed the feathers, and about 50 yards from where I saw them land. Feathers. There's a bird. dramatic <laughs> that's eight birds right there so <laughs> super cool birds just red beaks red feet so I can't believe I got a full limit on 
opening day. <laughs> so I, uh, I can't shoot any more checker, but I heard some quail below me earlier. So I'm going to do a little loop down below me. It's on the way to the back of the truck and, um, Hopefully we see some quail, I guess, but <laughs> I got a full pack of checker. Like I'm running out of spots to put them. So, but quail are super tasty too. And so are checker. So they would, uh, they'd go good together in a dinner tonight. So, all right. So I'll catch you on the way back. All right, we just made it back to the truck and ripped off a bunch of feathers already just to get them prepped to get cut up and stuff. And then we found a cool little bonus bird on the way back. So a rock dove and they're kind of neat. They, they eat all right, but they're just like a darker meat than chucker is. So they don't really look like a chicken. It's closer to red meat. So, but tomorrow, headed out again and I'm not sure if I'm going to go right back up into here or if I'm going to check out some new spots so I kind of I hunt this spot all year so or at least all season so I don't really want to get all the birds out of them but there's a ton in there so um, definitely will be going back but probably going to check out some new spots tomorrow and see what happens so hopefully it's another good day action filled chucker hunt <laughs>